guys, it's me again. I'm coming back today with the video to show you guys how to use the Lux Skin Laser Treatment. So this is an at-home laser hair removal. So I think I have been using it for three or four weeks now. I think that this week will either be my third or fourth week doing it. So you're supposed to do it um, once every week. So I do it every Saturday and I do it on my upper lip um, underneath my brows. Um, sometimes up top here and then I do my legs and my underarms and that's it. So right now I just got out of the shower, bare face, no moisturizer, nothing on. Because I want to pluck out underneath my brows and then do my mustache. I know. Weird, right? Yes. I'm a girl. I grow hair above my upper lip. Ooh. I'm pretty sure every girl does. And if you don't, you're one of the lucky ones. But I do. So, I haven't done anything to my upper lip. I've already shaved my legs and my underarms. So I can't show you those in the process of that. Um, probably should have before I went ahead and shaved it, but I can always do next week. So, um, I've noticed that after using this for like two or three weeks that the hair did slow down in growth. Um, I saw it drastically on my legs. Um, at one point it was my armpits. But then this week I ended up having to shave twice and I normally shave like once or twice throughout the week but depending on if I'm lazy or not. But I did notice on my underarms this week that I had to end up shaving um, on Thursday night because the hairs were just so pokey that it just was hurting too bad so I just went ahead and shaved instead of waiting until Friday night. But um, I did notice that in my legs it did like tremendously slow down the growth. Um, I would shave every like, I want to say like maybe um, two times out of the week, which um, isn't a lot for some people, but um, I probably should shave like three times um, without the laser because my hair legs were just growing so fast but I would just shave maybe like once or twice throughout the week on my legs just because I was lazy and I had other things that I wanted to do and that just took so much time but with the laser um, for my legs I only shave once a week and the hair is noticeable by Friday but I mean I shave Friday night so it's not anything that like concerns me like oh okay well I need to go ahead and shave because it already grew back no it doesn't matter that much to me but I have not shaved my upper lip and I have not plucked the hairs under my brow so I'll go ahead and show you that um, usually for my mustache I would I use this right here to shave it I use the Nair face cream which it just kind of like burns off the hairs, which I like because it just gets right underneath the skin and just burns it. So I don't mind that. Um, it does, I've noticed for me that I have like really sensitive skin, like not super sensitive, but like if I use a new product, sometimes I'll break out a lot. Sometimes I won't, it just depends. So with the Nair, um, I do have to put a timer on my phone and set it for four minutes or else it will start burning my skin like legit burns off my skin <laughs> so I've only had that happen like maybe four times where it will just tremendously burn and my skin will just start bleeding and sometimes I would have to like hold a cold water bottle over my face like mostly around these areas right here where my smile lines are at because like that's the most sensitive area there but for my brows, I just pluck them and then I just use the laser treatment and I've noticed like a lot of growth has like slowed down underneath here. 
So I'll show you guys my upper lip and underneath my brow before I go ahead and work on them. Okay, so this is going to be the growth of my mustache. This is after one week of not shaving it or using the nair cream or anything like that. The hair growth on my upper lip has slowed down tremendously. Like, I used to use the Nair product um, maybe two or three times out of a week. And now I only use it once on Saturdays. Sorry, my face is just dry because I haven't moisturized it yet. But let me see if I can get a better look at this. Like you will see some hair growth right here. That's where I grow the most hair is around here. And then a little bit up here. And then some over here. But over here is the most. And that's not even bad right now. Because I would usually grow more hair there. And then let's see on my brows. So I'm looking in a cam- not a cam- I'm looking in a mirror behind you guys. So that way I could see what I'm pointing at. So I'm going to try to do my brows. So let's see here. So usually if I don't pluck under here for like um, a week... I would have a lot of hair growth back, which, I mean, you can see some right here and right here, which isn't bad. And then I do grow, like, little baby hairs up here, which I don't really care if, like, you can see those or not. But, like, I guess maybe around, like, where it shapes the brow, that's where I care the most about. And then as well as, like, the center... You can see some hairs right here, down here, and then over here. And then I did have a lot grow back for this brow. But that's what I'm saying is like, you see for right here, if I don't use it under here, then I get a lot to grow back. Um, the last time I used it on my brows... For this one right here, you see I used it on the end by an accident, which it burned off some and like made the hair super curly. So I was like careful with it on this one because I didn't want that to happen again. So that's why um, some has grown back tremendously right here. But if you've noticed the difference, like from the places I don't put it on, the places I do, you can see the difference. This grows back slower. And this one's a lot faster. And then I also broke out right here as well. Which is going away, but that's okay. But yeah, so that's my face update. Um, I will try to do better next week to update you guys on my legs. Um, I'm not too sure if I'm going to do my armpits because I don't think anyone wants to see that. But... This is what it looks like. And this is where the laser comes out from. And this is the back. It's just on. And then right here, it has five settings or five levels. So I usually stick around to the one and the two. I think I'm going to try three today on my legs. But under my arms and my face, I will use a one. And then on my legs, I'll use a two. So I'm going to go ahead and finish right now and I'll see you guys after. So I'm doing my legs now and I have it on the setting of level 3. I have not used level 3 yet. If you hear it, it does have a motor inside. Which isn't a big deal to me because I don't use it often. So I don't really mind the sound. But I'm going to go ahead and start on my legs. This is what my lip looks like after I did the laser 
and the Nair hair removal. This is what my brows look like. Thank you guys for watching. So I will update you guys next week on how it all goes. I think I do have some clips from when I first started doing this. I'll see if I still have them. And if I do, then I will go ahead and insert them, okay? But thank you guys for watching and have a great day.